Dear students, I am Pratima. I welcome you all to this video. We are solving some extra questions, higher level questions from maxima minima from NCRT exemplar problems. So as I told, you have to read the questions very carefully. A telephone company in a town has 500 subscribers on its list and collects fixed charges of rupees 300 per subscribers per year. The company proposes to increase the annual subscription and it is believed that for every increase of rupees 1, one subscriber will discontinue the service. Find what increases will bring him or the company maximum profit. So this is your maximum minima, how it is used in commercial mathematics. So read the question, analyze the question. A telephone, telephone company has 500 subscribers. And he collects how much? 300 per subscriber per year. The company proposes to increase, but it thinks that if you will, he believes it believes that every increase rupees one, one subscriber will discontinue the service. Find what increase will bring the maximum profit. So let the uh, subscriber will discontinue as their X. Then how much will be increased? It will be per subscriber is one rupees. So there will be increase your 300. So let us now frame the equation. If needed, you can read the question again. There are 500 subscribers and it believes that their X number of subscribers will discontinue. That means how much will the remain subscriber? It will be 500 minus X subscriber will remain. Or will continue. The company proposes to increase the annual subscription as it believes that for every increase of one, one subscriber will discontinue. That means previously it was 300 and he will increase how much per one. X number is living. So it will be plus X for each subscriber. This is the contribution. of each subscriber. Then what will the profit? Profit will be total subscribers and multiplication each contribution. So this will be maximum. Then its derivative is zero. So let us multiply this or you can also use your product rule dp to dx is equal to zero. So 500 minus x constant here is one plus 300 plus x constant, it will be minus x. So this is equal to zero because profit is maximum. So simplify this. It will be how much? It will be 500 minus x minus 300. Or this will be how much? Minus y. It will be minus x. It will be minus 1 only. There is a mistake in the differentiation. So very sorry. 
it will be minus one. So it will be 500 minus X plus minus X minus 300 is equal to zero. What it gives you, it gives you minus two X is equal to how much minus 200 or X is equal to 100. So 100 subscribers will discontinue. So let us verify dp to dx first derivative is equal to your how much it will be minus 2x plus 200. Then what will be second derivative? Second derivative will be minus 2. So maximum verified. But we have not got the answer find the what will increase the bring find the increase will bring in the profit what will the increase the increase will be total your p is equal to p is equal to 300 plus x what is x x is 100 multiplies 500 minus x is 100 so it will be 400 multiplies your 400, 1600 is the answer. I hope you have enjoyed. Thank you for watching.